e a saúde ao Monsar. Blessed Rise family, continuing on the subject of land. So I posted a video of our land tour in the hills and we had quite a very good feedback. Thank you all for your comments and thank you for your blessings. So Rasta and I have gone ahead and um, we thought because we've walked this walk, why not share some information with the family? So I've gone ahead and I've done some research and I've gotten some accurate information for you, which will point you in the right direction as it relates to getting your land, your land ownership and your whatever it is relating to your land in Jamaica. Because I am aware that a lot of us Jamaicans do have land in Jamaica that we have inherited or we know that we have a right to because it could be your grandparents' land or your mother's land. But because you have no right to that land in terms of the legal paperwork, you just throw your hands up in the air and say, you know what, I'm not going to bother with it. So as such, because we've done it, we thought that we're not going to keep this information to ourselves, but we're going to share it with the family because he who owns the land has the power. Uh, let me shout out to my dear sister over at Hobby Money. Hobby Money, she is doing great, great work for us family. I need you to go ahead and check out her channel. That sister is really, really about the family and she's really putting in great research and great work into our channel. I need you to go over and support the sister. With that said, let's move right into the video. Hi. My name is Rhonda Stevenson, Customer Service Officer of the National Land Agency. The National Land Agency was formed in 2001 as an executive government entity responsible for land-related matters for the government of Jamaica. We have four core divisions, land valuations, surveys and mapping, land titles, and we also have Estate Management Division. As the agency responsible for land-related matters for the government, we are mandated to ensure that Jamaica has an efficient and transparent land titling system that guarantees security of tenure, a national land valuation database for property tax purposes, and optimal use of government-owned lands. Our top three products and services include or eLand Jamaica service, which is an internet-based service which allows persons to easily access property information at the click of a button. Or iMap Jamaica service allows persons to spatially identify parts of land in Jamaica and access some land-related information free of cost. Our latest online service is our Jamaica Property Watch that is renewable and allows persons to have one-year watch on your property or property selected. We can be contacted via telephone at 946-5263 or 750-5263 or by email at asknla at nla.gov.jn or visit our website at www.nla.gov.jn Land Talk the National Land Agency takes you on an information land guide so that you will always be on solid ground. Let's talk land. Hi Jennifer, long time no see. What's up? Pauline, you're looking good girl. Life has been good to you. Yes my dear, life has been great especially since I got my master's degree. I just got promoted at work. I would like to go back to school too, but it costs too much to go to university these days. You try getting a loan from the bank? Yes, but for the amount of money I want to borrow, the bank wants something to secure the loan. Come out of the way, my little kid on. Lord, we might never even dare so. Never mind, my dear. Back to what we were saying. You don't have anything you could use as collateral, like a car, house, or piece of land? No, no. The little car I have, it no value much. And I don't have any house or land. Wait. Wait a minute. 
You know, my mother gave me a piece of land in Hanover. I could use that to secure the loan. Does it have a registered title? The land has to be registered in your name for it to be used as collateral. What do you mean, land has to be registered? That land is in my family from how long, and nobody else can claim it. All right, hear me now. A registered title is a document that proves that you are the owner of the land. If you don't have a registered title for your land, other persons can claim ownership. So how do I get a registered title for this land? I got my land registered three months ago, so I can help you with some information. You said that the land is your mother's land, so the title would have to first be registered in her name, and then she transfers the land in your name. She will need to apply to the Registrar of Titles at the National Land Agency to have the land registered. And if it is not the entire land she's giving you, but only a portion of it, she will need to first get a subdivision approval from the parish council. It is the entire land she has given me, so I mean I need to get subdivision approval. Where can I get an application form to register the land? You can get the application forms on the National Land Agency's website at www.nla.gov.jn or you can get it from a lawyer. Let me write down the website. www.nla.gov.jm Will my mother need to send any documents with the application? She will need any document that proves she owns the land, such as a sales receipt, probated will, common law title or certificate of compliance under the Facilities for Titles Act. If she does not have any document to show that she owns the land, she must get what they call a statutory declaration from two persons who have known the land for at least 30 years. What do you mean by a statutory declaration? A statutory declaration is a written statement confirmed by oath. So the person who knows the land for 30 years would need to confirm it in writing how your mother got the land. Oh, I see. So if I get these two persons to stand in front of a JP and take the oath and have the document signed, then I have what you call it? A statutory declaration. So those are all the documents she would need to send with the application? No. She would need to show that all the property taxes for the land have been paid up. So she should get a certificate from the Inland Revenue Department. That's it? Is that all? She'll also need a survey diagram showing the boundaries of the land and the neighboring properties. The whole process of getting a title for the first time can be complicated. So it is best that she gets a lawyer. Thanks, Pauline. You sound like a lawyer. You sure you did not study law at university? No, my dear, but that sounds like something I could consider. You take care and all the best. For more information, please call the National Land Agency at 750-LAND, that is 750-5263, or 946-LAND, that is 946-5263. Or visit our website at www.nla.gov.jm. Well, family, we've come to the end of this video. I do hope you found this information to be beneficial. I hope you have noted some of the telephone numbers and the information that was relayed in this video. With that being said, I thank you for supporting my channel. I thank you for always taking the time out to leave a comment. Remember now, he who owns the land has the power. Do not leave yourselves powerless today. Make yourselves powerful and claim your land. Sort your titles and get your land in hand. I leave you now with love, light and upful energies. I also would like to hear from you. Let me know if you've got land in Jamaica or in any island or any country that you live in and you were actually thinking of just leaving that land and letting it go. Or have you inherited land in Jamaica but you were not sure as to how to navigate, how to go about securing your land? With that said, I leave you now with love, light, and upful energies. I'm out. Real Empress Yuda. Blessed love.
Shall be the eight corner stone one day Stone that the builder did 